Hello everybody and welcome to Jordan Robo's Vids. Today I'm going to be showing you how to build a freestyle scooter. Let's get started. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the different scooter parts you need to build your custom scooter. So first, you're going to need grips and handlebars. Then you're going to need the deck. Then the fork. Oh. <laughs> Then you're going to need two wheels, axles to hold everything together, a clamp so your bars don't come off your deck, the headset to make everything spin, a headset cap so dirt doesn't get in here, like that, and then an HIC shim. start building your scooter you're going to need different size allen wrenches for me the sizes of the axles on my scooter are either a size 5 allen wrench or the bolts I use are a size 6 allen wrench Okay, so now we are going to build the bottom half of this scooter. For this section, I'm going to be using the Allen wrenches the most. So let's start off by putting the front wheel on the fork. You're going to slide that in like that. Then you're going to grab your axles. And then align it with the middle part of the wheel. And then it should go through like that. You're going to grab your other side. You're going to twist that in with your fingers a little bit until you can't twist much anymore. You're going to grab your Allen wrenches, whatever size they are. You're going to go like this and then you're just going to tighten them. Now my front wheel is tight. <clears throat> so now we're going to put the fork in to the deck. Normally there would be a bottom part of the headset right here of this, but it's quite hard to get it out of the bottom of the deck. So I just left it in there. But so now I'm just going to slide this through like that. Grab my headset. Your headset has two pieces. If you don't have these two pieces, your headset won't fit right. Oh yeah, and <clears throat> don't be afraid to like get dirty or get grease on you. Have like a towel or napkins near you so you can wipe your hands off. The headset has grease all over it, so that's what I'm warning you. So these have two pieces, so just a normal headset and then a little shim piece that just clicks in like that. You're going to grab the fork, put that over, slide this in, and grab your headset cap. Put like that in also. You're going to grab your HIC shim, slide that on. You're going to twist in this little bolt. Depending on what fork you use. There's different bolts that are, you use. For me, it's this shaped one, but other forks have different bolts and different sizes for them. So I'm using my Allen wrench once again, right here. Tighten all this up. Now the bottom of your scooter is built. Okay, 
So now we're going to build the top half of the scooter. First of all, you're going to have your grips. If you go to a bike shop or scooter store that will build your scooter for you, they have air compressors to slide on your grips. Then, second, you got to put in the bar ends. On each end of the bars, there is a hole like this. You can choose to ride bar ends or not. I ride them so I don't cut myself. So they just slide in like this. Don't slide in all the way, but then you use pressure and just slide right in like that. And then now we're going to put on the clamp. Your clamp should align with the slit on your bars. Depending on what compression you use, SCS or HIC, your bars may have this slit or not. But mine do. So on the clamp, you have these line that should align up with this. So I will put that on right now. Okay, so now that your clamp is on, you're going to want to tighten it a little bit. Not all the way, but just and grab your bottom half of your sheeter and just slide the bars on. And after you can straighten the bars to however straight you need them or adjust them to the alignment. But since that'll take a while, I'm just going to tighten everything up. Now that your scooter is built, as you can see, you can go out, try some new tricks. I'm going to demonstrate a couple of tricks for you at the skate park. Hope you enjoy. Now that your scooter is built, you can go out and ride. Hope you enjoyed the how-to video and the tricks. Thanks for watching.